Hi, I bet you're watching today because you want to know how this Eda bag from the con differs from this Eda bag from eBay. These bags are trendy. I mean, you see them all over cons right now, full of different kind of buttons, pins, keychains, and sometimes flushes. They're really fun and that's why I had to have one because I'm crazy about customizing things. Just right off the bat, I can't seem to tell many differences so far, but we're going to open them up, play around, and see what we find. Let's start with the bag from the con. We got this bag from Animazement at a booth that had Eda bags of different kinds, sizes, different, I guess like, you know, like throwover bags, some of those like over the shoulder bags, you know, all that stuff. This one was 40 and they said that was on sale. So we're gonna look at it and see what, you know, how it, how it be, how it do. All right, so looking at it, just looking at it, it looks nice. Feeling it, the material's thick. The ribbons in there are real good. The straps and everything, there's like a cool, like, I don't really know what to call that material, but it's nice. There doesn't really just, you know, there doesn't seem to be any threads sticking out. And it just, it overall looks pretty nice. So let's open up this pocket where you put the keychains and buttons and, you know, I guess really whatever you want to put in there. This is my favorite pocket because, like I said, I like to customize things. I had to have it for that reason. So there's like good room in here. I feel like you could fit something kind of large if you wanted to. As long as, I feel like as long as you can zip around it, you know, it should be good. And the zipper is really nice. It's in there really good. It doesn't get caught or anything. Like that's, that's a peeve of mine. If it gets caught, I'm like, mm, why you do this? Let's look at the inside of the bag. All right, there's pockets here, I guess, for like, you know, wallets, phones, which is nice. And then there's pretty good space in here. I feel like this would be like very convenient for a con. Yeah. So it's like lined on the inside with like a, I don't really know materials too good, but this is like a, like a kind of stiff material. I like it. And I feel like it's easy to clean. So that's a plus. It looks like it's stitched good. It doesn't look like it'll fall apart. And again, the zippers. Easy to do. The straps are adjustable. But I'm not going to do all that. I'm just going to kind of... Well, I'll use mine. This is a friend's. Mine's just a little worse for wear. And uh, I don't want to like adjust her straps and you know be like, surprise, it's different now. So I'll be right back. Okay, so this one's mine and I also got it at the same con, only I've been wearing it a lot. So I, I thought hers would be better because mine's a little more worse for wear. For example, um, here's a uh, taco sauce stain. Uh, you know, that, that happens. So the straps are adjustable. Let's see, I guess you can just Okay, they're easy to make looser, but are they easy to make tighter? Oh dear, maybe, maybe I just have to, I'm, ne I'm never good at these anyway, which is unfortunate, but you know. Okay, so they're not difficult to work with. I probably won't want it to be that tight. So I'll go ahead and loosen it again. I'm really good, I'm good at stuff. Wow. So easy tightening and loosening. Nothing difficult, nothing too irritating. Also, this feels really firm, which is great. Because, you know, you don't want it to be all floppy. I don't really know. I think that's pretty much how I would evaluate it if I were going to buy something. Anyway, again, these ones from the con, specifically an amazement, were $40 on sale. Now, let's move on to the eBay Ita bag. So far, I don't really feel like too much of a difference. I want to say that this feels a little thinner and the zipper looks different, but it could just be because it's a different color. You know, obviously it's on a black bag, so it's not going to be a white zipper. The 
little zipper parts look the same? Here, let's open this up. This doesn't feel quite as, um, it seems a little more flimsy than the other one. Like, it kind of... And it doesn't look like there's as much room in here either. Like, down here, like, there's like a small little space. And I don't think it was as big as the other one. So we'll move on. The zipper's also fine. I think the zipper's easy. So that's good. This strap seems to have that same kind of material. The ribbon, the ribbon looks great. It seems like to be, you know, just the same kind as the ones in the other bag. And the, goodness, I can't remember what these are called, but they're in there pretty good. Let's look at the inside. Now I'm going to puff this bag out because right now it looks really skinny because I haven't like... Oh! Okay. Well, I have to say that these pockets are a little bit bigger. This one's kind of tighter though. Like in the other one they seem to be kind of like equally spaced. And I think that this one has less room in it. Like I don't... It appears to be smaller. I think you could still fit enough stuff in there if you wanted to for a con, but there is definitely less space. In fact, I will go grab the other one and we'll compare them. Alright. So I was wrong, this pocket is also tighter. I guess it's like, I guess one's for something thicker and one's for something thinner, I don't know. But looking on the inside, I think that you can also tell. This one's definitely, they're both unzipped all the way. This one has a lot more space. Um, like this one's all the way flattened right now, I think, at the bottom, and this one is not all the way flattened. So that should already kind of give you an idea. Here, I'll just like spread them out. Yeah, like even feeling on the inside of it, this one has, I think, you know, it's more than a little more room. Let's see, let's put them like beside each other. This one also kind of appears to be like bigger this way too. Like this seems wider here than this one does. Um, so that's a that's a big difference, I think. Well, let's get to the straps on this one. I'll put this one away. Let's see how adjustable these straps are. So if you wanted to loosen them, it's about the same, I think. Maybe easier. That could just be because maybe the straps are thinner. Though I can't tell just by playing with them. They also have that lining, which is nice. And this, the inside has that that lining also of that like shiny kind of stiff material. Let's see. Let's... It went up a little easier, I think. So. I think overall that there are some differences. Before moving forward, I'd like to remind you that before you order anything online, that you're careful to read the description and check the seller's feedback. Overall, I believe that these bags are pretty similar. The one from eBay is definitely smaller, but it's $20 less than the one from the con. So I guess, basically, is $20 worth it to you for more room? Thank you for watching. I hope this video clarified a few things for you. If you liked my review, please subscribe to my channel and hit that bell for notifications. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment, and I will get to them as soon as I possibly can. I'm Mint Bell, and I appreciate you for watching my video.